An investigation is underway into the deadly Amtrak crash. The train originated here in Washington, D.C. Tuesday night and derailed in Philadelphia. Service has been shut down in parts of the Northeast Corridor. Other service modified, leaving passengers today at Union Station scrambling to make alternate arrangements. Today, authorities are sorting through the twisted remains of Northeast Regional Train 188 to determine what went wrong when it derailed in Philadelphia around 9.30 Tuesday night, killing seven passengers and injuring hundreds of others. Amtrak has stopped service between New York and Philadelphia and modified trips between Washington and Philadelphia, sparking a mad dash among riders to find other ways to get to their destinations. I knew there was an accident, but I was under the impression that they would have transportation if we could not continue. Clara so McMillan is trying to get to Penn Station. Management didn't come. Nobody told us anything. Nobody knew nothing. She's one of many riders waiting in the growing line for buses. It's a bit frustrating because I'm getting mixed messages. Downstairs telling me that there's only um, buses to Philadelphia. Coming up here is actually an entirely different story. Hopefully we'll get a seat. Hopefully we um, can make it to New York tonight somehow. At Union Station, some commuters like Ella Council have been stranded for hours. I'm going crazy. I'm getting hungry. I want to go home. Somehow I didn't get any messages this morning, so now I'm checked out in my hotel. Despite their frustrations, passengers express sympathies for the victims. My condolences to all the victims out there. Um, we feel for them. Now commuters can go on Amtrak's website and blog for updates on scheduled changes. Meanwhile, Amtrak has set up an assistance center to help family and friends of crash victims. From Union Station, I'm Rochelle Metzger, CTV News.